begin with breaking news in Gardena and a deadly shooting. Los Angeles County Sheriff deputies shot and killed a private security guard tonight. His family showing up and calling out deputies. We were there as a very tense situation unfolded late tonight. KCAL's Leslie Marine is live on the scene with this breaking news story. Mm -hmm. Leslie. Hey, you guys, it's been a very tense situation out here in Gardena. We just heard from sheriff's detectives who tell us the shooting happened at an auto body shop after they say the suspect in this shooting um, took out a gun. At this point, we are still waiting to get more information. But what we know right now, if you can take a look behind me, um, the guards family, uh, a lot of family, friends, we know uncles, aunts have all come down here. Um, and this is as close as they can get to the auto body shop. And it has been a tense night. We were actually here when the family showed up and they faced off with deputies wanting answers about their loved one. Uh, just before 6 p.m. this evening, deputies assigned to Compton Station were patrolling the uh, unincorporated county area of Gardena. Uh, when they came across a, uh, um, a male Hispanic, approximately 20 years of age. Uh, the deputies uh, observed the individual, at which point he observed the deputies. Uh, the individual then produced a handgun and began running southbound away from the deputies through uh, businesses nearby. Uh, the deputies uh, engaged in a short foot pursuit through the, through, be, between the two businesses. Um, at, that, at some point, the deputies contacted the uh, suspect, and that's when the uh, deputy involved shooting occurred. Did the uh, gentleman. Okay, what you just saw there was a very tense moment as the guards family first showed up tonight. They faced off with deputies, of course, demanding answers about what happened. That is the guard's sister and uncle that first showed up to the scene. Now, family and an auto shop employee did give us this photo of the guard. They say his name is Andres Guardado. He is 21 years old. Tonight, family described him as a hardworking young man going to school with two security jobs. They say he had been working at the auto shop for some time as a guard and just like any other day came to work today. But an employee at the freeway auto shop told us tonight Guardado was patrolling the front of the shop when police showed up. He says officers drew their weapons and that is when the shooting happened. He says he is furious. Police shot the young man. We had a security guard that was um, that was out front because we've just had certain issues with people tagging and stuff like that. And then um, the police came up and uh, they they pulled their guns on him and he ran because he was he was scared and they shot they shot and killed him. But he's got a clean background and everything. Um, there's no I mean there's no there's no reason. Well, here's a look at the crime scene from above. Deputies say it happened at the freeway auto body shop near Redondo and Figueroa just before 6 p.m. Uh, the sheriff's department has not said why they were first called out in the first place. Of course, we are waiting to get more information from them as they continue to investigate. I will tell you, we did see Sheriff Villanueva out here. I also asked uh, one of the employees who was working at the time of the shooting whether this guard is typically armed. He tells me that um, he is not for from his knowledge, but of course, um, we will wait to get more information. I will tell you a very tense situation out here in Gardena tonight. Reporting live, Leslie Medin, back to you guys in the studio. All right, Leslie, thank you.